Hey guys, okay. Finally, I'm able to sit down. <laughs> My arms are killing me. I don't know why. I went walking. I did um, six laps. Y'all saw that video. I decided to come home and make some tortillas thanks to my cuñada who decided to entojarme los tacos. <laughs> so, Gina, this one's for you. <laughs> so I wanted to make a healthy tortilla, which um, is not like super perfect, you know, um, like it's not completely vegetable. It's got flour in there but it has vegetables in there too to kind of slow the digestion and add more greens to your diet. So this is what I came up with right here. They're green tortillas. You can see right there, they look exactly like tortillas. And um, I made some chicken with beans and some veggies in there and stuff. I put some hot sauce. So yeah, so these tortillas right here, um, they're nice and thick. I'm gonna eat here on camera. So you guys can see that they're good. So in the video, the live video that I did, you heard my hubby say, so I'm going to experiment. I was like, yeah. So then I took it to him while he's working because he works from home. And I was putting it on his nose and he was on a call. <laughs> I was all like torturing him. I didn't let him, I didn't let it, I didn't let him have it until, you know, he put that person on hold. <laughs> Hopefully his boss or supervisor is not watching. Anyway, um, so I made him smell it before I gave it to him. And so then I told him, take a bite out of it. And so he did. And he looks at me like, oh my God, I know. It's good, right? Can you believe it has cauliflower, cilantro? And it's got, um, it's got um, cauliflower, cilantro, green onions. And baking powder, salt, flour, olive oil. And so this is how they look. You can see they're not super, super thin. They're okay, they're pretty good. Kind of remind me like a little bit, no, it's not even like a pita. It's a little bit smaller than that. Stick in between a pita and a, so it could be like a really good wrap. So you can see it looks like a tortilla. So anyway, my food's already cold for after doing all that work. So. But tastes good. Mm. It tastes like a tortilla. You can't really taste the cauliflower, cilantro, any of that. But it's in there. Um, the chicken was really good too. And I'm starving, so that could be another reason why it's so good. But it really is good. Um, so like with one of these tacos, it would be enough. But I'm actually having two because I did a lot of work. I did I did six laps and all that work. I'm barely having breakfast and it's 12.10. And I left the house. I left my apartment at 7.50. Okay. And I'm barely eating right now. So it's a lot of work to be healthy. But... If you already knew the recipe, it wouldn't take you that long. You would just prepare it. I was experimenting, so there's a difference. I probably would have finished earlier. Mm. It's really good. <laughs> I just need to check hubby and see if he went up too high in his sugar. I don't think he should because I didn't add too much olive oil. There was a lot of flour involved because what happens is, is that I think maybe next time I'll add less water because the cauliflower tends to release a little bit of water. And I didn't add like a ton of cauliflower. You can see the pictures on my timeline. But you need to hurry. And make the tortillas really quick as soon as you get the like the consistency you want because it starts releasing water. So you need to hurry up and make the tortillas as fast as you can. Because if you let the the flour like sit there for a little bit, like the um 
the like the masa i don't know how to say it the yeah the masa if you leave it there for too long the water starts um coming out because of the cauliflower so you need to hurry up and make them so if they don't get all sticky and then you have to flower again that's the problem if you're going to add cauliflower you're going to have to add more flour as you can see when i was doing the video um I had to continue to add flour because because of the cauliflower. It was letting out some of some of the water. So, but it's really good. Hopefully, it doesn't make me gain weight. I mean, I'm not gonna be eating this all the time, but it's a healthier way to eat tortillas, I think. Plus, I'm eating all um, I'm eating black beans and chicken and vegetables and. I did a huge workout right now with barely eating at 12 o'clock. Mm. If I would have added more olive oil to it, I probably would have not needed to flour so much because And, and less water. If I would have added more olive oil and less water, but I wanted to make it healthier. I didn't want to add too, too much, um, too much oil. Even though olive oil is good for you, but still. This is really good. I really do recommend it. You know, I've always wanted a place where I could go to eat some good food healthy food obviously you have your subway that's a ton of bread though you have like Jason's Deli is pretty good you have the salads and stuff but I would like to go to a place where You have like the green ceviche and you have like, but I like to go to a place where they have like different stuff, like not the same foods over and over. If I had the money, I'd probably open up a restaurant. I would. But I'm only going to cook. Because the cleanup is terrible. <laughs> I clean for the most part while I'm cooking. Because I hate seeing dirty counters and I hate seeing dirty stoves. I hate that. But like washing the dishes and everything afterwards, it's a pain. So I tell hubby, I'll cook, but you're cleaning up. Or if not, I'll pay my daughter and She'll clean up for me. She'll do the dishes, not clean up. I clean up. I just don't like doing the dishes. It's a pain in the butt. If it were up to me, right now I'd be using a paper plate. <laughs> so I could just toss it. But I have to make it look pretty for you guys. So I can take the picture. It doesn't look too pretty if you put it on a paper plate, right? Mm. I'm super full. But it's really good. Especially adding that little Tabasco sauce at the very end just for a little kick. It's pretty good. I'm going to have my daughter try it when she gets home from school. So she can tell me what she thinks. And even my son, he won't eat anything that's green, but I'm going to let him taste it, and I'm going to see if he'll eat it. He's really like, he won't. He'll make something up just so he won't eat green. Like, I used to buy some veggie sticks that I used to buy at Sprouts, and they were like green and orange and... Um, 
like a beige or yellow color. And he never wanted to touch them. And I was like, Papa, they taste good. They, they're not bad. And now he loves them. But he's just really like that. Anyway, that was really good. I deserved it. Muy rico. So, hopefully you guys try it out. Let me know what you guys think. I'll try to, I guess, put the best recipe I can because it was a lot of, like, add here and... Lots of water. No sodas for me. I'm seeing the weight loss for sure. I can see it in my face for, it's starting to look thinner. I can feel it in my pants, um, in my clothes, it's just fitting better. So, you gotta keep going, gotta keep experimenting, gotta keep coming up with healthy recipes to help myself keep going. And, yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this quick video. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye, guys.